This is Cap Brit showing you what to put together to make a teapot lid hat, or at least that's what I call them. These are vintage 1950s hats. The pattern we're going to use is 8052. To shape the hat, we're going to cut out some buckram. So you need scissors and lightweight buckram. Buckram is shaped with a dressmaker's ham to hold the shape at the edges. 18 gauge millinery wire, and when you buy your millinery wire, buy the joiners. They help eliminate cuts in your hands and twists. Then I cover the wire with double-sided bias tape, and I sew a seam. So it creates a sleep. And the wire is shaped with needle nose pliers. These are jewelry pliers and they have a cutter. If you don't have those, just a regular needle nose and a cutter will work just fine. The hat will be covered on the outside with crepe back satin. The satin side will be on the top, crepe side on the bottom. Crepe side helps cause some friction for the hair, helps hat stay on better as well as satin side on your hair, slicker and snot on the doorknob to help hold the hat in place a comb. Sometimes you can get these in clear but most of the time you find them in brown. So that is everything you need to make a teapot lid hat. Y'all come back the next segment and we'll have some more mischief putting these things together.